Okay, in this video we're going to be talking about uh, how to uh, work on two sheets that were uh, given out in class. The first one is called Ladder of Tens, and, and then uh, you should be good to go. Okay. Right, the Ladder of Tens. That simply means that what you're going to do is you're going to look at uh, this number here and you're going to multiply it by any random set of 10. Okay, so the idea is basically, it, it's meant to reinforce the idea that if, for example, we know what uh, 2 times 4 is, obviously that's 8, then we should be able to work out what 2 times 40 is, and we should be able to work out what 20 times 40 is, and so on. All right, so in this case here, where we have 20, I'm going to maybe multiply it by uh, 3, gives me 60. Okay, and then I would write in 30 here, and I would write in 300 here. Okay, so um, for 40, I might multiply it by uh, 2, then 20, then 200. And for 80, maybe I multiply it by uh, 4, then 40, then 400. Okay, this one here is meant for a challenge if you want to multiply it by um, uh, 3,000 you can um, but it's it's up to you this one is uh, kind of optional okay alright so uh, if we know that um, 3 times 20 is 60 then we know that 20 times 30 is going to be 600. Okay. And if we know that 20 times 30 is 600, then we know that 20 times 300 is going to be 6,000. Okay. So let's go over to the 40 here. If we know that 40 times 2 is going to be 80, we should be able to work out that 40 times 20 is going to be 800. And we should be able to work out that 40 times 200 is going to be 8,000. Okay? And that's basically all you do. You just, going down here, you just pick random uh, single digit numbers and then you turn them into a set of 10 in this uh, one here, and then into a set of 100 in this one. Okay? Let's go on to the next one. It's called the multiplication of tens and hundreds. Okay? Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you. This one is a straightforward multiplication. Again, we've got 3 times 40, uh, which is going to be uh, just... You would work it out by 3, what's 3 times 4? Well, 3 times 4 is 12, okay? And then just multiply the 12 by 10 gives you 120. So that's going to be 120. And you just write the answer in the box there somewhere. 6 times 4 is 24, then multiply by 10 is 240, okay? So if we know that 6 times 40 is 240, then we know that uh, 2 times 4 here is 8. Multiply it by 100, it's going to be 800. Okay? We know here that 3 times 40 is 120. So 3 times 4 here is 12 again. And then multiply it by 100, 1,200. Alright, so you just write the answer anywhere in the box, 
Okay, but the, the important thing is to look at the digits that are at the beginning, the 9 and the 9, and the nine of 900, and then multiply it by either 100 or 10 to get your final answer. So it's pretty straightforward. It's not uh, overly difficult. Just remember to check your work. Okay, good luck.